warm up should bring more people out along the river walk tomorrow. Remember, that's your last chance to check out the event at Julian B. Lane if you don't have a ticket already. But still, plenty of things happening everywhere throughout this weekend. And it is, there's just a lot. We're talking about Armature Works all the way to Sparkman Wharf. Plus traffic, look, it's not going to be easy, but 10 Tampa Bay's Madison Allworth takes a look at how the city is helping you get around. We wanted to make sure that everybody that was going to be in town and going to be visiting and going to want to participate in all the activities had a way to uh, move around downtown. The new Super Bowl shuttle started operating today, giving people a great way to get around the city without the hassle. We're able to expand uh, what's accessible for parking uh, so that you don't have to walk for an hour to get to your to your parking spot. Instead, you can hop on the shuttle. It will loop you around to all the great destinations along the river. There are nine stops with service roughly every 15 minutes. The great thing is it's a short trip. It shouldn't take very long, so uh, you can hop on and hop off, uh, but masks are required. Getting you to every corner of the Super Bowl experiences. Not only are we serving some of the some of the awesome spots downtown that we know people want to visit, some of the landmarks, we're also serving the Super Bowl experience and some of the other key destinations that are here uh, for game day. Another way to avoid bringing your car downtown is to use a bike share or a scooter. They're so easy to use. All you need is an app and they can be parked anywhere. Rides are way up. The first week of the month, there were 11,560 rides. Last week, that increased to 17,240 rides. Four companies have scooters spread around the city. They're a great way to avoid traffic jams, but you can't take them on the river walk. So if you want to hit both Curtis Hickson and Tech Village, your best bet is to walk. The Super Bowl shuttle is free and will run tomorrow through Saturday from 11 a.m. until 11 p.m. Plenty of ways to get around our city. And